What we're going to do in this video is figure out a way of getting started making our web page and our CSS file really quickly and try not to waste any time in trying to figure out where the files are or what you're doing. So let's get started right away. I've opened up brackets and it's opened up with its normal page. This isn't the page I'm working on. And I also did a quick preview and Chrome has opened up and also this is not the page I want. So let's get going. We're going to go to brackets. We're going to go to file and new. We're going to open up a new file and immediately I'm going to go to file and save as. And what I want to do is make sure that this is saving in the correct place. Uh, save it any way you need to save it. At this point I'm going to save it on my desktop. I'm going to make a new folder and call that website like so. And then what I'm going to do is of course name my HTML page index.html. I've done that. And immediately I'm going to go to file and new and I'm going to go to file and save as and I'm going to save that in the same website folder which is on my desktop and website and I'm going to save that as style.css and press save. Those are my two files. You can see that in the top right, index and style. At the moment I'm going to work on my index and you can see I've got the wrong web page over here so I'm going to disconnect and then put the live preview on and hopefully I should just get an empty window here. That's perfect. Now let's get beginning with our website. We always start with the triangle, exclamation mark, capital letters, doc type, small letters, HTML, close. We then go HTML and press enter a few times. We then go to head, press enter a couple of times. Let's go to title, like so. Let's just write a title down. And underneath head, let's put body, like so and press enter a couple of times. There's our web page ready to go. Let's press save. In the quick preview, obviously, we don't see anything because I haven't typed anything. Now we've got our CSS file, which is our style.css file. We haven't actually written anything in there. It's empty, but it would be really nice if we already put a link in the head. Now remember, the link to the CSS file has to be in the head and not the body. So what we're going to do is triangle. We're going to put a link. It's a relative link, so we press that. Let's go and find the style sheet, like so. We are going to have it as type text.css, and then, of course, we want to put the href or where it is as style.css. Now, really important thing to note because I saved it already in the correct folder. Brackets is already looking for the file and you can see that style.css is there. If I click on that, that means I don't make a spelling mistake and we close it like so. And then we are ready to go with our website design. So go ahead and watch the next video so that you can understand how to make the website and how to make the CSS file.